Yeah. I first met Dr. Shutter as a first year doctoral student at Arizona State University in 2016. I distinctly remember how he spoke to me as another, as a human speaks to another fellow human, discovering shared familial roots in New York City and Wisconsin. I would have never known what a giant he was in the field if I had only relied on his own admissions of his work. I never felt the need to learn how to deftly dance around hierarchical boundaries between us because he made sure not to construct them in the first place. As a non-traditional PhD student coming back to the academy after having worked in the field as an intercultural practitioner, it felt like a continuation of the field. He helped me feel like I belonged in the field and in this branch of the academy. Whether in a one-on-one -on -one office conversation or addressing a classroom full of graduate students, Dr. Shutter infused each word with a vibrancy that to me felt like belief in the limitless potential of each person he addressed. The vibrancy felt like excitement to walk along that journey with those of us just beginning our academic trajectories. I could feel the respect and consideration that he gave other humans lived experiences as intercultural scholars and humans, regardless of whether others had yet validated those experiences through published research. In this subtle way, he conveyed integrity to each one of us in every conversation and every lecture. Perhaps it was that vibrancy and integrity that made Dr. Shutter seem ageless. His energetic reserves undepleted by a rich personal and academic history. His passion to encounter the new seemed boundless, whether it was the latest dance shows that came to Tempe or exploring unfolding realms of new media. Exploring new subjects with Dr. Shutter felt visceral, much like life outside the academy, all the while exploring it with the rigor within the academy. I feel very fortunate to have had a chance to have worked with him with the Center of Intercultural New Media Research and to have learned from his years of multinational organizational research and consulting. I will do my best to carry on his legacy of lifelong passion and curiosity to meet the always unfolding on its own terms.